finally, of course, you want to consider the needs of your learners. What will best suit their needs and personalities? Will they be open to having a little fun? Most people are. Are they up for high energy activities? That's a little different. You want to consider the age, the maturity, the learning level, the abilities and interests of your learners. If you have learners with physical limitations, are you taking that into consideration when planning your strategies? I was recently at a conference where they did a gallery walk, which is a common strategy used with large groups. Unfortunately, there was a participant in a wheelchair who couldn't maneuver to the different parts of the room, so she couldn't participate in this activity. Now, I personally struggle in large groups when they break the learners into smaller groups for discussion because I have a slight hearing problem and can't always hear people in my own group with all the other noise in the room. So taking into consideration the needs of the learners is also critically important.